Uh, I fell through that hole. Thankfully, I didn't keep falling that way. Trapped alone, 70 feet below the ice, Professor John All was broken, bruised, and fighting for his life. My right arm is seizing up. I can't use it anymore. While conducting climate research, All was hiking alone on a Himalayan mountain when he plunged into a hidden icy crevasse, improbably landing on a ledge just three feet wide, his face bloody. Oh. All suffered several broken ribs and a fractured arm oh. from the terrifying fall. But like the survival drama 127 Hours, the professor made a life-saving decision to climb out, his camera in tow. I hurt bad, but I gotta get out. It's funny the amount of uh, damage that a body can take and still function pretty well. The pain was wonderful, let's put it that way, because I was at least alive to feel the pain. It took around five agonizing hours, all making his way to the top with an ice axe, eventually reaching his research team's camp, where the professor was later rescued. It happened so quickly that I was thinking, oh, God, thank God I stopped, and that I'm still alive, because I didn't, I expected just to keep going until it was over, and to have hit the ledge and catch that little piece of ice and save my life. All's family still can't believe he made it out alive. He could have been a goner for sure. If you look at it from the video, he could have just kept on going down. And I don't see how you get out of that. I mean, if you look up, you see the sky. I don't know how you get up there if you don't, got, if you don't have one of your arms functioning. Professor All said he recorded his ordeal because he wanted a record for his family and because he says it actually inspired him to survive and to keep climbing. Jason Carroll, CNN, New York.